A car crashed into the fourplex, knocking the stairwell down. Now exactly one month later, tenants are staying at hotels or with family, waiting for it to be repaired. The incident involved a stolen car. Tonight, we talked with the owner. Exactly one month, and this fourplex in Las Vegas is still without stairs. On Valentine's Day, a Ford Focus crashed into the complex, knocking the stairwell. Video of tenants on the second floor can be seen climbing a ladder and then using a chain to lift themselves over the railing to get to their unit. Dean Perez saw our report a week ago when Fox 5 talked with tenants. That's when I found out that, you know, my car was um, involved with the accident. That Ford Focus was Perez's car, stolen in January. I mean, I was already frustrated enough the day I found out my car was stolen and the day I found out that it was wrecked. His car is now undrivable. He's bothered tenants on the bottom floor are being evicted. And that was even more frustrating seeing how those people were, you know, getting evicted, getting kicked out of their house because of some guys' responsibility. Currently, all the tenants are staying at hotels the owner of the complex is paying for, but some are checking out Monday morning, and this is how the stairs look today. So that alone is already frustrating enough, too. Um, honestly, right now, I just hope that, you know, those people get taken care of and that I, um, you know, like I said, nothing's going to bring back my car or my property, but just hope that Metro are able to do something about it. Now, the couple in the bottom unit received a three day notice to quit for nuisance from management. The notice said on 02 1421, a car crashed into our fourplex, knocking the stairwell completely off. We are doing our best to get situation resolved. Moving upstairs, tenant out, dealing with the city and code enforcement. It's a lot of pressure. We have to have workers. We reached out to management to clarify this notice and we're still waiting to hear back. Tonight, tenants were told management booked a hotel until Wednesday.